Hey, what's the matter? You people and your God, you just, you know, you talk in circles. You offer, you offer just enough evidence, but never enough to be conclusive. Then you fill in all the gaps with, oh, well, yeah, you just got to have faith. It's a bunch of nonsense. You're really irritating, you know that? Yeah. Don't start with me, Kenny. You don't waste a lick of time bragging to all of us how great a reporter you are. So why can't you put up or shut up on this story? What are you even talking about? Here's where the chili meets the cheese, my friend. One of my heroes was C.S. Lewis, a man who began as a skeptic, much like yourself. At the end of his journey, you know what he said? He said, if Christianity is false, it's of zero importance. But if it's true, there's nothing more important in the entire universe. So you want your wife back? Well, hey, guess what? People in hell want ice water. Not everybody gets everything they want. Stop blaming me and the church and God and do your job. Stack up the evidence, follow the facts, and write the story, win or lose. Please soften Lee's heart, put a new spirit in him, remove from him his heart of stone and give him a heart of flesh. The only way to truth is through facts. The entire Christian faith hinges on the resurrection of Jesus. If it didn't happen, it's a house of cards. Hi, you just have to show that Jesus died and was seen after. How can we be sure of the reliability of those manuscripts? Archaeologists have recovered 5,843 Greek New Testament manuscripts. Nothing else in history even comes close. Do you trust the Journal of the American Medical Association? Yes, Jesus Christ died on that cross. You can't tell me what I hope to hear today. It is true. Wouldn't you want to know that? The first recorded account tells us that he was buried in a tomb. The empty tomb is based on evidence. Isn't evidence your trade? Faith is the evidence of things we can't actually see. Any careful historian will see that the core account is consistent, even if a, a few of the secondary details are told from different perspectives. 500 separate people saw Jesus at the same time. That would be an even bigger miracle than the resurrection itself. The disciples reported what happened. People with zero motivation to lie. When is enough evidence? Enough I felt something that is maybe more real than anything I've ever felt in my life. This is not a condition. Still takes a leap of faith. But why would he do it? It's really very simple. Love. <laughs>